Hi guys, uh, today I have not one scent box, but two scent box for you, for us to smell together, for us to experience together. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Andy, and I'm really happy that you're here. You guys, I've been trying to decide how I'm going to do this. Am I going to wear them and then give you, tell me, tell me what you would rather see. Would you rather see first impressions? Because I know... <laughs> Most of my first impressions are not favorable, but uh, they can be entertaining. Would you rather see first impressions or would you rather see, like, see a review? Like, I've worn it, all of that. Let me know. Let me know in the comments below which you'd rather see. Um, I have two because one of mine is a replacement for the monstrosity from last month that was terrible. Uh, it was bad. It was just bad. And scent box, you get one uh, free return a month. And I don't usually return them. Like I usually will pass them along to someone who I think will love them or who has mentioned, oh, I really like that scent. I don't know why you didn't like it. I love it. And I'll send it to them. Whatever. Sometimes. Uh, sometimes I pass them along to my best friend. Um, you know, just whatever. So I don't always send them back. I, I very rarely send them back. I think I've only sent one other one back. So I decided to do that. And if you didn't know, scent box is a monthly subscription bag. Uh, you get one cent or you can get two cents per month. They have a base level. They have a premium level and they have a bougie platinum level. And the base level is like $15.95. The premium level, which is what I get, is $20.95 and then the platinum bougie level is $29.95. And I don't think I, I had kind of thought about going up to the bougie level, um, but I'm not going to because there are so many to choose from. If I run out of things to choose from on the premium, the base and premium, because if you're a bit if you're a premium, you get access to the base as well. Um, I think I'm just gonna I don't know, go with a different one. I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, uh, the scent of the month is the Oscar de la Renta Bella Blanca. It is a natural elegance and pure grace of white flowers with woody and musky undertones. Um, the notes are pear, musk, jasmine, and amber. And then that was the female fragrance. And for the male fragrance is Polo Black from Ralph Lauren. This fragrance is for the urban professional male of our time. Polo Black is sexy, mysterious, and slightly dangerous. A bold fusion of iced mango, silver arme, armoire, arm something, and patchouli noir. Modern, daring, and sophisticated. All right, then. Uh, this notes are mango, sandalwood, patchouli, and tonka bean. Now, I am not a fan of patchouli. I have some upcoming scents that have notes of patchouli in them. I'm just trying them out. So let's go ahead and get started with this. Um, the one that it was my replacement is Black Opium uh, by You Say Laurent. Um, yeah, Black Opium. I love opium, the scent opium. Um, I love Poison better by Dior, but I do love opium. And so when I was looking through my choices, which there are, it's vast, vast amount of choices. I decided that I was going to try this. Uh, it has some notes that I'm not, I'll put the picture and put the notes down here. And I can't remember what it was that I was just like, mm. uh, but we're going to try it. We're going to try it out. This is what it looks like this month. In case you want to know. It's cute. I do have a code below. If you sign up, you get a free month and I get a free month. How great is that? Where you get a free scent and I get a free scent. I should say that. All right, let's try it. Okay, wait a minute. I don't put it on my skin yet. I've learned. Oh, oh. Okay, we're going to let that marinate because I think that smells amazing. We're going to let that marinate on my skin for a minute. Okay, this one is my monthly scent for October. 
Uh, so you're probably seeing this in November because I get them way late in the month. And this is L'Ombre de um, Marvels. Marvels? It's French, guys. I don't speak French. But it's by Hermès. So I was like, okay, Hermès is very, is very bougie. We'll try it. Put the picture of the bottle here. You know, packaging is so... It's peer pressure. Packaging is very motivating to buy, which is why the packaging, it, things cost so much because of their amazing packaging, right? Um, so, a lot of times I see a pretty bottle and then I look and see what's in it. I should look and I should search by notes, but I don't. This is pretty. Look at this blue, tealy. Oh, that's really pretty. I like that. Can't smell anything. I'll tell you why I'm not sp spraying it on my skin yet. Oh no, that's not happening. That smells like straight ass bug spray. Mm -mm, no, and that's why. So last month's I sprayed on my skin. Oh, that's bad. Why does it smell like that? It's Hermes. I don't get it, you guys. I don't get it. Um, and it was at Eau de, Eau de Toilette, which is a higher quality than Eau de Parfum, which I, and I believe is an oil base, which makes it last longer on the skin. I could not get it off. Like, I washed my arms, and I could still smell it. And I had trouble sleeping because I could still smell it. It lasted forever. I didn't like it. I know. Okay. So I know that your chemistry will change the scent of a perfume. I know that. Oh my gosh. That smells sexy. I think opium smells sexy anyway. But this is... Oh yeah, this is a keeper. Oh my gosh. Now, if you've been with me from the beginning, you know how many I've actually kept because I like them. Like maybe four. Oh, why am I putting that back in the box? Okay. Black opium. Definite winner. Definite winner. Oh, that smells good. Oh, Anthony's going to like that. He's going to like that one. And it's a good winter scent. I make sure that I put like my winter scents in the winter, spring, spring. Spring in the spring, fall in the fall, summer in the summer. I, I do that. Because I do wear scents depending depending on the season. The Dior uh, Poison Hypnotic, which is my favorite hypnotic poison, is a very nice winter scent. Okay, so this is not good. It smells like straight bug spray. It's and not a good kind. Because my bug spray smells really good because it's all natural. But this smells like some stinky chemicals. I'm really disappointed. I really thought Hermes would smell good. Tell me if you guys have ever smelled the Hermes. Um, again, it is... I'll write it down here. I'll, I'll put the, the thing down here. L'Ombre de Mer... Mervies? Mer... Mer Marvel, Mar, Marvies, I think a double L is a I. Like the the Palace of Versailles looks like Palace of Versailles, but it's called the Palace of Versailles in in Paris. Marvies. I don't know, you guys. It doesn't matter. It stinks. It stinks. I'm just saying. Thanks, you guys, so much for joining me while I do my scent box for November. No, my scent box for October. Um, yeah, uh, I'm going to keep up with this subscription. I really like it. Even though most of the scents I get, I don't care for. I still like trying them. And I mean, I have found some that I really like. So yeah, I really appreciate being here. Until our next adventure, I hope everybody has a great day. And we'll see you later.